Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today in this pretty quick video, I'm going to check the new Spedix 2306.5 motor by GEPRC. This motor is available in 3 KV options, which I'm going to bench test using my Moto Thrust end. Unfortunately, I don't have a complete set in hand, so I won't be able to feature these motors in a build and flight video. However, if you are interested in seeing these motors in action, please let me know in the comment section down below which version you would like me to test and I will try to make it happen. The motor KV options are 2450 KV, which can handle up to 5S LiPo batteries, 1850 KV, which can handle up to 6S LiPo batteries, and 1350 KV, which is relatively low, and this motor can handle up to 6S LiPo batteries, spinning 7-inch propellers. The weight of the motor is 34.9 grams, it's using 15 cm long, 20 gauge silicon wires, and its motor belly secured using an M3 screw. After removing the M3 screw, you'll be able to detach the motor bell, and since these are pretty strong magnets, I recommend to use this motor grip tool in order to hold the base of the motor, and then remove the motor bell like that. Here you can see how the motor bell looks like. On its top side you can find a grip pattern for the propellers, and on its inside you can find 14 high quality magnets. Now I'm going to show the thrust test, and in addition, in the description box of this video, you can find a link to the full results of my test. As far as I can tell, the quality of these motors look great, and according to my thrust test, these are pretty powerful and also efficient motors. As you are about to see, I did smoke the 6S 7-inch version on my thrust test, however, these thrust tests are more demanding than real life, and I think that if you are going to mount this motor on a 7-inch quadcopter, you'll be able to get away with 6S, just don't spend too much time on 100% throttle. As always, I thank you for watching my video, I hope you enjoyed it and you find it useful. If you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comments section down below. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up if you like this video, and consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notifications bell if you're not already subscribed. See you on my next videos, and goodbye.